Hey, what's going on, guys? I um, was in the middle of trying to order some Tally One Piece mounts for this Savage, and I ran into a couple questions I need to come needed to come down and uh, verify before ordering, and I figured there would be a good opportunity to do a video on um, this pretty neat tool from Brownells that I picked up and I haven't had a chance to use yet. So, figured I'd just do a quick video with it and. Uh, introduce you guys to it if you have, don't already know about it. Um, but the first thing I needed to know um, on the tally mounts was whether or not the Savage had a rounded rear or a flat rear. As you can see here, this one has the flat rear. Um, and then the next thing I needed to know was whether it was uh, 648 threads or uh, 840 um, because both of those are options. Oh. And that right there is what I'm going to use to figure it out. It's called the uh, Brownell Screw Checker. And it has pretty much every um, standard size that you might encounter in the gunsmithing world. It's pretty neat. Uh, it gives you your, your drill size. Um, even has a little rule on top if you needed to measure the length. And I figured using this might be a little easier than me just grabbing a screw and threading down in or mic micing it's easy too, but I just wanted to give this uh, tool a try and show you guys it. So let me take one of these screws out and we'll verify what it is. So right there's our screw, and like I said, it's either uh, 840 or 648, so here's the 648, looks like that's going to be what, what we need, um, I'll just go down to the 840 just to show you and it just drops straight through so it's clearly the 648 um, and one more thing was that this thing uh, I don't know if I would do it often but you could also use this um, for shortening a screw um, so you needed to take some off the length because it was bottoming out um, you could screw it in here and leave exposed to the amount that you wanted uh, to remove and then you just take it to your grinding wheel and you grind that flat and then being that you have it in a threaded hole when you back it out it's gonna take the burr off the thread and um, then you'll have a screw that will easily screw back in not that I need to do it on this one but that's a nice uh, added bonus with that screw checker I'm just going to throw the screw back in for now until my mounts come, but yeah, it, uh, it's like 16 bucks. I think, um, the metric, they make a metric one also. It's a little bit more. It's in the $20 range, but I just picked this one up for now. Um, and it comes with a, with a card, um, with some information on it. I haven't read through it yet to even elaborate on it, but it kind of just describes everything the screw checker can do. So, yeah, pretty neat tool. Um, definitely something nice to have, uh, whether you're a gunsmith or just an enthusiast. Uh, it's great to know um, what screws you have laying around or what screw... Uh, specific gun needs so I'll throw a link in the description for this um, if it's something that interests you pick one up um, questions comments leave them below thanks guys